Hello guys and welcome to a new video And in today's video we got some pretty intense game Where I had a bit of a rough start in construction site Against some decent teams But surprisingly I had a good teammate with me And we managed to get back into the game And fight our way through to the end I really hope you guys enjoy the game Let's get started So our team decided to split apart here but the place they were landing in doesn't really have a good loot and that's why I didn't follow them. The places that I'd recommend landing at are construction site, turbine, hydro dam and nuketown island. If you play in a full squad and you land in areas other than the ones I mentioned then you're most likely gonna struggle with loot. Especially if a lot of enemies land with you. And you have no idea how many times I died in these places just because I ran out of ammo or heals. So I started to avoid them. There were too many enemies here so I decided to back out for a bit towards the side buildings to try and get better loot and recover my health. And once I did that, I went back for more action. Watch out, K9 unit incoming. Your drop is coming. This guy had one of the craziest aims I've ever seen. He had few bullets left on his mag, but he managed to hit every single bullet. And I think all of them were headshots. I still managed to knock him out, but his teammate finished me off. There wasn't really much I could do there. Luckily, my teammate knew what he was doing and he scanned my tag, then he left the area to get to the airdrops. Most of the airdrops were landing next to us. It's like Activision wanted us to win this game and we got all of it. So just like that, I was back to the game and in a perfect condition, ready to hunt more enemies. Enemy down. Enemy eliminated. The airdrop is coming. Watch out. Your drop is coming. Your drop is coming. Oh. 
For some reason, I keep forgetting that my teammate is using smoke bomber, and every time he uses it, I think it's the enemy's smoke. We arrived to the final stages of the game, it was us against two other squads and we were outside the safe zone. So we had to push inside which means that we were forced to fight our way in. But the question here was which squad to fight. And the smartest decision here was to push the enemies near estates because there are buildings and good cover to play around. Sadly here I lost my teammate and I don't think I could have done much to help him. I think he should have used his smoke bomb. I really don't know why he did it. Not only to survive but he could have actually gotten some kills with it. It's perfect for situations like this in open areas. So in the end it was me against 6 players and I decided to chill here for a bit and observe the area to plan my next move accordingly. In here, I was running the open to bait him to push me since he was alone. But I think he was focused on the other team. Most of the games I play on this map mostly ends in the open, but this time I got lucky with some good cover. And as I said, it's like Activision really wanted us to win this game. So the first step is to open and close my scope to get a speed boost from the fast ADS legendary mod. That boost combined with a loadout MX9 with a hipfire mod was so deadly. The enemies also made mistakes here, they were overconfident, pushing me one by one. This guy uses an AK-47 which stands absolutely no chance against a loadout MX9 in close range. And then the second enemy was relying a lot on deploying his shield and I believe it failed to deploy in the start and when it did it was already too late he should have just attacked with his teammate instead of wasting all of that time and the last enemy used his poltergeist poorly guys if you're using poltergeist then you need to take advantage of the first two seconds because during that time you're completely invisible so use it to get a head start over your enemy and you're guaranteed to win the fight but this guy wasted his time moving around so he was visible to me and I managed to kill him fast I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay and if you did a like would be highly appreciated Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.